Today's weather will be sunny, high 45 degrees, low 34 degrees. Have a great day, Portland. Work, work, work. Our lunch today will be pizza, green beans, corn, green salad, and a carrot. Enjoy your lunch, Portland. Today's fruit snack will be for Pharrell. Good morning, Portland. Today is Friday, January 18th. Welcome to school today. We're going to start today's morning announcements with caught being good. Meet me at the prize cabinet by 9.30. Landon Martin, Stephen Wilson, Billy Masters, Noah Skillern, Alexis Bowman, Justice Kelly, Brooklyn Moody, India Rollins, Kane Culver, and Bryce Collard. Connor Kenny, Kara Carwile, James Crabtree, and Sherard Gibbs, Ronnie Aller, Michael Cook, Jordan Thompson, Alex Stubblefield, Travis Hibbard, and Davey Gibson. Boys and girls, for the month of January in your agenda, we're focusing on alertness and action. And if you go to the front part of your agenda, it's our quester's story called The Wrong Path. And you need to read the whole story because this week we're talking about what happened with the questers and why they got lost. Well, you're not able to take the questers quiz to see why they got lost if you haven't read that story on a few pages. And if, if it's a challenging read, you can certainly ask a grown-up to help you. But the big deal is what is it if you're being alert and what is it if you are being um, taking action? Well, the definition for alertness is that you are aware of what is around you. Also, if you're alert, it means you're watching and learning from what you see. It's very important in our lessons that we are aware of what's going on around us, that the, we are watching and learning from what we see. That might be that we're watching and learning from the teacher. It might be that we're watching and learning from volunteers. And it might be that we're watching and learning from other students if it is group work or a group model from another student. So you have to be alert. That is sort of like paying attention. But alertness also requires you to have had enough sleep and also to have had enough to eat. So to help you be alert, make sure you got enough sleep and that you've eaten your breakfast and your lunch. The other part of our January focus is taking action. You have to take action when you're focused on a problem. That can be a math problem, a question in reading, a task you need to do for writing, but you have to take action. You can't just sit back. The answer is not going to come from magic. You have to take action and you have to work through it, and you have to do work using your brain, using your thinking skills to figure out problems, thinking about what you know and what you're learning to help you figure out that problem. So let's be alert and take action. Please stand in your class and put your right hand up while we say the we can't pledge. I promise to hurt no one. I, I promise, promise to hurt no one. one. And words are action today. And words are action today. I use my hands for helping. I use my hands for helping. I use my words for kindness. I use my words for kindness. I include everyone. I include everyone. Through personal
personal responsibilities. Doing personal responsibilities. Having a positive attitude. Having a positive attitude. Giving quality workmanship. Giving quality workmanship. I will be successful. I will be successful. Have a great day, Portland. Please stand for, for your class and pledge your allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States.